Hi, this is Simon Clark, Sales Development Manager at Vitec, looking after the Autoscript and AutoQ prompting ranges. Here at NAB 2016, we've got a couple of new products which fit both the top-end broadcasters and the more enterprise market, and software systems that bridge across both of those applications. At the very top end with the Autoscript Epic system, we now have a really cool picture-in-picture -picture system which allows the presenter to see not only the, the sharpest, highest, brightest script, but they can see themselves on the talent monitor, they can see an outside broadcast feed, they can also look at the next script, uh, next story coming in the script, all within their eye line. also they're not distracted from what's happening around. Down at the, the more enterprise level and for mobile um, news applications, the iPad Pro system here, using the 12.9 inch screen from Apple, we have uh, the same glass that we use in the on-camera systems in the studios. We have a uh, metalwork which will accommodate full ENG size cameras right down to DSLR DV size cameras. Uh, we have a prompting system where you can control that script outside on location. The cool item that bridges both the studio and the outside broadcast mobile prompting using an iPad, WinPlus Remote enables the, the script that's being used in the studio to be automatically uploaded to an FTP site, to the cloud, and then downloaded to the, the presenter wherever they are in the world. They can click on a button and get that exact same script delivered direct into an application on the iPad, allowing them to speak very clearly using exactly the same script that they're using in the newsroom studio. So Epic 19 system from Autoscript with um, the highest bright prompting system, um, picture in picture display with a remote control and an iPad Pro mounting system for mobile um, prompting system, whether it's for broadcasters, enterprise, independent content creators. For more information about these products, you can visit the AutoQ website, autoq.com and autoscript.tv.